Good evening, my beautiful collective. Today we're going to get on here and just get a short little reading for you. Yes, I'm feeling guided. Yes. Our dear gracious Heavenly Father, we come to you today and we ask you for a prayer protection and a cloak or protection and cover us in the blood of Jesus so then our enemies are not able to find us or harm us anymore. And please, dear God, send in your divine protectors. Please protect us at all times and all places, Lord. And we are truly grateful for all of our blessings in which you bestow upon us each and every day, Father. And I humbly say these things in your blessed name, Jesus Christ. Amen. In your Father, the Son, and the Holy Spirit. Okay. Court's in session. <laughs> yeah, bitches. Two of cups. Should we fucking about two of cups? <laughs> All right, my phone might shake a little bit because I have it on this, like, unsturdy tripod. So, yeah. Okay, I'm really feeling that, you know, there's some, like, ooh, okay. There's some um, unseen forces out there that are trying to keep you from a queen of cups. Okay? Yeah, and a commitment. Okay, four of wands here with uh, the queen of cups here. Um, there are some unseen forces that are trying to stop you and sabotage you and your path. Okay. This could be somebody that's, uh, in the past or in your past, um, trying to come through, but it's not going to be able to. Okay. Yeah. In seven of cups, you see them very clearly. Okay. There's no clouded, uh, confusion anymore. They have no, um, they just have nothing on you collective. Uh, but you got, you can't fear, you can't fear because whenever we fear, that's whenever we put, um, doubt in, in existence and we do not doubt, um, our gracious heavenly father's, uh, word and we do not doubt anything for a second. Okay. You need to stand in your power, stand in your truth. King of wands here, um, six of wands here. Okay. They're trying to, um, I I'm hearing like, um, wish, uh, yeah, six of wands, that's the victory card. So they're trying to wish that you do not have victory, okay? Um, you're really being guided to go within at this time. Maybe, um, like, do one of your power protection. I'm sorry, you guys, I look like shit right now. I didn't even take a shower. It's laundry day at my sister's, okay? So it is the way it is. Anyways, I have no makeup on. I just put my stuff on. Oh, okay, that's relevant. I'll shut up. Um, <laughs> um, also stand in your power, have, have confidence in yourself. Okay. Because the only one that could sabotage your confidence is you. Okay. And there's, uh, something very significant about a queen of pentacles here in reverse. Okay. There could be a toxic Taurus that is wishing ill will on your two of cups. Uh, this toxic Taurus does not want to see you happy. He wants to keep you in a state of fighting and confusion with your divine counterpart. But I do see here that you are coming out of that. Um, this is not a, going to affect you as long as you speak it into existence. Now, the other day, I also um, put a reading out saying that, you know, maybe we need to go to our favorite beef jerky store <laughs> and we need to get some obsidian. Okay. I'm just saying. Um, yes. Some obsidian would work really good right now. Okay. It, it will bring, it'll break those chains that are trying to bind your two of cups. It'll break um, any kind of ill will or toxic uh, thoughts or feelings that um, there's a evil, toxic ass fucking Taurus out there that's trying to wish ill will. Okay. Um, trying to um, Knight of Wands here, like, you know, make you uh, not think and move quickly. So then you miss your a chance on your will of fortune. So we already know that we're the star. Okay. We already know our energy. We know how to discern our energy from anybody else's out there. And we, we know how to stand in our power and protect ourselves. And I'm really feeling guided too. That's what we need to do. We need to stand in our power. Nine of Cups as well with the Star card. Uh, stand alone. You know, stand in your power, stand in your truth, and nothing can hurt you. Nothing can phase you. Plus, you got the whole fucking arch Archangel Angelic Army right behind you. Okay, Collective? Um, yeah, your angels are so overseeing you get hurt. Uh, yeah, you're an earth angel. You are an earth angel. Okay. Archangel Michael is coming down. He's sounding that trumpet and we're kicking the devil's ass devil in reverse here. Yeah, we're, we're not, we're not taking any shit anymore from you, Satan. So you know what? Your power has nothing here, Satan. 
you are not welcomed. Your power is not welcomed. And all you and your little fucking minions could just march right on back to hell. Because Archangel Michael and Gabriel and Raphael's here. And I'm also hearing um, the whole entire angelic army. And we will unleash on your ass. So know your fucking place, Satan. Stay, stay, stay where you're supposed to be. Yeah. Mm -hmm. uh, right now, collective, you're, you're being told to post up. Don't move. Don't go nowhere. Wherever. Oh, my nose is itching. Uh, that came through with a, a, another reading, another investigator that's on here on tar uh, tarot. Um, came through, too, that wherever you are, wherever you're parked, if you're a truck driver, if you're just on the road, wherever you are, post up. Uh, say your protection prayers. Um, keep your protection on point. Burn some sage, some palmacento. And um, it's almost 555, so that change is almost here. Now it's 555. Uh, that change is coming, okay? Um, post up, uh, do your protection prayers. Make sure they're on point. If you don't know them, look them up on YouTube. A really good one that I like is the Archangel Exorcism Prayer, which I was going to play during this reading, but I forgot <laughs> again. Okay, so yeah, just make sure that, um, you know, and if you got things to do, if you got work to do, Three of Pentacles here, carry on your day. You don't let nobody phase you, Collective. You carry on your day, you stand in your truth, you know your power, you know your protection, and nothing could phase you. Yeah, strength card under that, under our three of pentacles. You're, um, for you to stay grounded and for you to stay in your truth, I'm really hearing that, you know, you just, you keep going about your day. All right, ace of pentacles here with the strength card. You keep going about your day collective and you do what you got to do because ain't nobody going to stop us. Ain't nobody going to stop us now. If God hire me, who going to fire me? Right, Maji? Yeah, that's right. And you know what? I also have an aunt, Maji. And she, she passed away, God rest her soul. But um, she's from Long Island, New York. Mm-hmm. Yeah. I got a lot of family from Long Island, New York. That's right. All my shout out to Long Island. <laughs> I'm from California. I was born in California, okay? Pomona. Little hippie hospital. And, uh, yeah, so I was born there, but you know what? I, I, I feel so pulled to New York and stuff like that. And I think it's because of all the pain that came through New York. I mean, you think you got all those ports from long, from, um, Ireland, Europe, uh, you got every port there that hits through straight through New York. And, um, yeah, a lot of, a lot of powerful manifestors also come through there, but also a lot of people too, that, aren't on the good side <laughs> and they're powerful too so we got to make sure our protection's on point you guys okay mm -hmm. yeah let's make sure our protection's on point and that we are pulling energy from the correct the correct side the correct source because uh yeah transformation too or you could be dealing with a very significant scorpio <laughs> just saying just saying just saying anyways <laughs> Yes. Um, oh, have patience. Okay. Have patience. Good things come to those who wait. That's all I got to say. Okay. Okay. All right. Um, yes, things are moving in your favor collective. Um, yeah, things are, things are definitely looking up, definitely looking up. I want to show you guys this too. Uh, before I go, I went into my favorite beef jerky store and I got, I, I got some beef jerky too, but that shit's gone. Um, <laughs> but I got these obsidians. Okay. These are what they look like. They are clear. I don't know if you guys can see that. Yeah, there you go. They're clear. It almost looks like glass. Okay. These are called obsidian stones. Okay. These are very good protection stones. If you notice too, it's like a mirror effect. Okay. Look into the mirror. Hmm. Hmm. <laughs> yes uh demons and negative energy hate obsidian um especially if it's blessed by a divine healer just saying <laughs> yes bless them by god just all you gotta do is just say a prayer of protection over them um this one's a little bit thicker than the other ones but um yeah these are very good and then what i like to do is my little himalayan singable okay we just place them inside the bell I love bells. I Every time I hear a bell, I think like an angel gets his wings, okay? So I go ahead and shake them. And 
I what I always do is I hold my my fingers like this, okay? And then I turn it up. Turn it up. So you're pointing up to God, okay? It's hard to do though cuz There we go. This is this is how I hold it, okay? You're pointing up to God and you're shaking. You're shaking the stones so you're clearing them. You're purifying them by the sound and vibrations of the heavenly realms, okay? And then you protection, protection, protection. Power of three is a universal number as well. Okay, and then we. Ooh, these had. Had sand in there. Okay. All right, and then. Um, <laughs> see, that's cleansing them. All that dust that just came off. Yeah, okay. I'm going to have to go take a cleansing shower after this. Anyways, uh, pointing up, always. Beautiful. Chakra. And crown. Pointing up at all times. And that is it, collective. That was beautiful. And now I'm going to put one of these in my car by my Bible and then I put one in well I got an amethyst in this side of my bra I got a, a rose quartz crystal in this side of my bra so this one I'm, I'm not gonna tell you where I'm gonna put no I'm just kidding <laughs> no I'm just kidding you gotta have a sense of humor okay can't be like all white white pure white all right yeah, you gotta have sense of humor too. God loves sense of humor. Um, no, but I'm probably gonna end up putting this one like by my um, amethyst that's in my bra. Okay, that one's for my third eye and my crown chakra energy and then a protection for my heart, which I'm gonna, I usually don't do this on camera, but I'm trying to help you guys out. Okay, so protection for my heart is on this side of my bra. So it's, and it's close to my heart. It's close to my crown. It's close as close as you can get it, all right, collective? Um, yeah, and that's about it. <laughs> I know I'm a little um, different, to say the least, um, but it's what's gotten me through, and I just really feel guided and pulled to help you guys out and, and teach you how I got through it. And I'm still getting through it. I mean, do you see the smile on my face? <laughs> it's not all marijuana, okay? I'm just saying. <laughs> All right, I love you guys, and um, I will be getting on here later uh, for another little energy check-in because I feel a storm a-brewing, and well, I like to sit back, kick my feet up, and eat my popcorn and just let the whole shit show just ride on out, especially the karmic shit show, and that's what's coming up. <laughs> So get comfortable, collective, get your snacks, get your drinks, and get your footstool and kick up and just make sure you're in a comfortable situation and a comfortable place where you feel divinely protected because uh, as the karmic shit show is about to begin. I love you guys. I'll see you soon. God bless.